Today we're gonna look at some Irish spring hacks. So I've got my soap, little grater here, and all I'm gonna do is start by grating the soap. And so you can do as little or as much as you want. So we are gonna start right here with our windowsill. So all you're gonna do is sprinkle a little bit of your Irish soap right there in the windowsill. If it rains, it's going to basically clean your windowsill, but it will also keep the flies away. So when you're done, just go ahead and close your window. Flies are often attracted to garbage and what's inside. So another thing you can do is take your Irish spring and just sprinkle a little bit in the bottom of your garbage can to keep flies away as you are filling your garbage. This is an area in our yard where we had some bowl damage and we're in the process of mending the damage that was done. So what I'm gonna do is take some Irish spring and I'm gonna sprinkle it around this area. And the point of this is that rabbits and other animals don't like the smell of it. So they will avoid this area and it'll allow our grass to come up and heal in this space. The same thing goes if you have a flower garden. If you have some pests, like some squirrels and other animals are eating and picking at this, simply surround it with a bunch of Irish spring and those pests will leave. Next, I'm gonna take a little bit of Irish spring and the amount really depends upon where you're at and how many bugs you have in your area. You're gonna place a funnel on top and pour some water in. Now, if you need something more potent, you can always add some vinegar. And I'm gonna go ahead and give it a little bit of a shake. Now, over time, the soap's gonna dissolve. And so what I'm doing here is creating a spray. Now, this spray is good for a bug spray. It is also great to spray any leaves outside or like your rose bushes or any bushes outside that maybe are being attacked by bugs. Okay, you might remember we were talking about Parmesan containers and Parmesan lid hacks and how I use them. Well, this is just a mason jar, or actually it's a recycle jar. And I'm gonna place a bar of soap inside and I'm gonna place the lid on top. Now, I'll show you what I'm gonna use it for outside. Another thing that I can do with this is I can take the shredded pieces and place them into the recycled jar. I can place the lid on top and I'll show you what I'll use that for. Now I have this old lantern from Ikea and I simply place the jar inside like that. Then next when I'm coming to sit outside, I can either open either side. So I can open the small side or the big side, but I'm gonna go ahead and open the big side like so. And this helps me when I'm sitting outside, enjoying the outdoors and then it scares the bugs away while I'm sitting out here. Now this is my front porch, so I wouldn't want to make too much of a mess, so this is an easy way to scare the bugs away, but then it also helps keep the scent fresh because when I'm done, all I have to do is close the jar. Next, we're gonna talk about doorways because a lot of times bugs are flying in and out of our doors, so how can we stop and prevent that from happening when people open and close our doors just naturally? Now, one of the easy things you can do is hide soap somewhere on your porch. And you may remember my terracotta pot turtles. So all I need to do is take my soap, lift up my turtle, place my turtle on top of the soap, and the smell can come out from underneath here and it radiates through the whole space, therefore keeping the flies and bugs away. But it's not just a bar of soap laying around. This is our door that goes in and out of our garage. And so I may not have a pretty DIY or something that I can put by it, but I'm gonna teach you another little trick you can do with just the regular bar of soap. So this is our door's edge, and all I'm gonna take is the edge of the bar of soap, and I'm just gonna rub it onto the door frame. And I'm gonna go all the way up and all the way down as much as I can reach. Now I don't have to reach the top, but ultimately what I'm trying to do is rub it on the door. So this is the cracks, but you might also wanna rub on the outside edge and the inside, depending upon, mostly hopefully we're just getting them outside. So you'll just wanna also rub it on the outside of your door as well. So another place you can consider, consider it is around your table. So you're just gonna go around the table here and it will keep kind of the flies away from your table as you're eating. So you just need to go around and hit the edge of your table 
And you can also hit chairs this way just by using a bar of soap. Now we mentioned doing your doors, so don't forget to hit all of them. Going all the way around all of your doors and hitting all the nooks and crannies just giving it a light coat. And again, keep in mind that when you do this, you are going to need to redo it after it rains. This is our apple tree and squirrels love to climb up this thing and I've always got something eating at this tree. So as I mentioned before, taking one of these lids and putting the shavings inside allow me to either use this side or this side for this useful project. So instead of having to grade it up every single time, I can have one mount and then I can just go around this apple tree or plant or whatever I need to and sprinkle some around it. As I said before, not only can this be used on plants, but it can also be used as a bug spray. And I have been known to spray my poor dog too when he is in distress as well. So just staying away from the face, of course. Just simply squirt it on yourself all over and have somebody help squirt it on you if you are not comfortable putting it on your skin. It is just soap and water, but you can also spray it on your clothes if you'd feel better about that. Alka-Seltzer is made of baking soda, citric acid, and aspirin. These are great cleaners and deodorizers, as well as help me speed clean some things and save time and energy. Clean and deodorize coolers. Fill the bottom of the cooler with water and add five tablets. Let this stand for 15 to 30 minutes. Use a scrub brush and lightly scrub the bottom. Wash the cooler out. It'll clean it and deodorize it. Deodorize your fridge. Fill a glass with one cup of warm water and place one tablet into the glass. Sit it in your refrigerator, close the door, and leave it for 30 minutes. Use it to clean your coffee pots and coffee cups. For a glass coffee pot, fill your coffee pot with water and place a couple tablets in your pot and let it sit for 10 minutes. For a stainless coffee pot, fill it with water and add two to three tablets let it sit for 15 minutes or more, depending upon how dirty it is. For coffee and tea stains in your coffee mugs, pour one cup of warm water into your mug and add one tablet. Let it sit for 15 minutes. Pour the Alka-Seltzer water out. Wash and look how clean they are. Make a multi-purpose cleaner. Place one cup of warm water and one tablet into a squirt bottle. Use to clean up surfaces like counters, sinks, and more. Clean and deodorize your plastic containers. Fill with warm water, add a couple of Alka-Seltzer tablets, and let sit for 20 minutes. Dump out the mixture and wash as usual. Your plastic will be clean and deodorized. Clean your vases or glassware that has gotten cloudy, have rings on them, or small openings that a brush can't get into. Fill with warm water and place a tablet into each one. Let sit for 10 minutes. Pour out the water, wash, and look how clean they are. Use it to clean your toilet bowl. Place four tablets in your toilet bowl and wait 30 minutes. Scrub with a scrub brush and flush. Use it to clean your sink and drain. Fill your sink with water. Place two tablets in the sink and wait 10 minutes. Let the sink drain. Use a paper towel to wipe up the sink and rinse it. 
Doing this routinely will also keep your drains clean. Deodorize and clean water bottles and thermoses. Fill with warm water and add one to two towels depending upon the size of the item and how dirty it is. Let soak for 10 minutes and wash afterward. Pour out the water, wash, and look how clean they are.